Now we know that the typical orthomosaic workflow can include multiple pieces of software and require several iterations before getting to an acceptable quality level. Today's orthomosaic workflow is inefficient and time consuming. DSM to DTM filtering often requires the use of complex 3D editing tools, iterative orthorectification, oftentimes through trial and error. Adjustments are made, new orthos created, and are then visually inspected. Geomatica 2014 introduces game-changing technology that streamlines this process and gives you real-time live feedback on the final product as you make changes to the input imagery and DEM. The new live DEM editing tools that run inside Focus take full advantage of this new capability. It's best to work on a complete project which includes automatic DEM extraction through OrthoEngine, which will be used in the orthorectification of the imagery. Using the input DSM and the uncorrected imagery, the analyst can perform live edits to the DSM in order to properly remove the surface features and instantly inspect the resulting ortho quality. Several filters and tools are available from the DEM editing panel, which can be adapted to remove surface features correctly. The analyst can pull up a one-to-one -one ortho preview window and see the effects of their DEM edits. Once they are happy with the changes and have completed all the QA, QC, the final DEM can be used for orthorectification and mosaicing. This way, your final product will look exactly as you expect. As part of the Geomatica 2014 product launch video series, we've put together more detailed videos on key topics for live DEM editing, including when and how to use automated versus manual DSM to DTM filtering, how to determine the accuracy of the final product using live DEM editing. Editing complex features such as overpasses, forests, and complex terrain, and much more. Be sure to check those out to get a deeper dive on this innovative technology.